Hi friends, today we are going to see some uh, short book summary of uh, a book named uh, Habit, Your Master, Our Slave, written by Swami Sri Paramahamsa Yogananda Ji. So, habit, be it good or bad, it doesn't uh, form immediately, right? Over a period of time, through repetitions, we form a habit. Uh, so, be it smoking, drinking, even overindulgence in caffeine uh, or, uh, you know, binge watching Netflix series or whatever it is. Uh, so it doesn't form immediately through repetitions of the same act again and again now we form a habit so sometimes these bad habits take overpower on us it's like a master for us so how to get rid of that so he says first guard yourself against the first instance first performance of that bad habit so what you do once you're likely to repeat again so people who are having some wrong habits delusionally think that there is nothing wrong in doing this at first time because you're not going to suffer the pain immediately uh, this week or next month or whatever it is so how to overcome our bad habit um, so first we should convince our mind that we are not going to repeat that uh, habit again for example uh, drinking every day night or whatever it is okay take some habit for instance so we convince our mind and then we should cultivate some new habit uh, to you know to counter affect this old habit for instance uh, Instead of drinking daily at night, uh, we can have some family time together or we can go for a night walk, something like that. And thirdly, we should change our environment uh, he, because this may give a good uh, impact on, uh, you know, destroying some bad habits. Uh, the people view on us, the positive people around us, it's very important. Uh, he says that the greatest influence in your life than your willpower is the good environment, uh, good company of people around you. So, if needed, we should change uh, our environment. Uh, some of the points to remember while forming a new habit. Uh, first is to remember that everything takes time. Even forming a good habit or destroying our old habit both takes uh, uh, some amount of, reasonably some amount of time to get rid of it. Uh, and secondly, we should have patience and we should be encouraged by the fact that whatever we have done so far, whatever habit we have created so far, some bad habits, so to say, uh, we can undo that so that flexibility of mind should, should be there uh, to overcome this and thirdly some of the good uh, habits for example having a, a proper diet doing exercises regularly having a meditation rot routine can largely impact on uh, whatever uh, mental attitude we are in so in meditation generally we focus on one thing at a time being aware of everything else that is happening on a day-to-day -day basis even if we revert back to our old habits we can become aware that uh, okay this may happen once i can change it the day after so that kind of flexible mindset uh, helps us in uh, you know forming a new habit uh, these are some of the points uh, in this uh, short book uh, habit your master or slave thank you friends uh, if you like this video kindly like share and subscribe our channel and uh, suggest us that uh, what kind of videos uh, you like from our channel and uh, so so that we may have uh, some insights that what we should do next uh, be it uh, vlogs or uh, this book review or even cooking shots or whatever it is kindly suggest us uh, what you like thank you